tonight. We're learning more about a shooting that took place this morning right outside of Havana Grill on the east side of Colorado Springs. It's the second shooting in that area in the last three days and the fifth confirmed shooting in Colorado Springs just this weekend. Over the past three days, the violence has resulted in two confirmed deaths, but there's still a lot that we don't know. Police have not announced any arrests and have said that all of these investigations are still ongoing. And with that, we find KRDO News Channel 13's Annabelle Childers live at the Havana Grill, Havana Grill right now with what the restaurant owner there says happened. Annabelle. Yeah, Spencer, police have not answered our calls today about what happened in these five shootings over the weekend. But we did speak to the owner today of Havana Grill here, and he wants to make it very clear that the shooting that happened this morning did not specifically occur on the restaurant's property. Instead, it occurred on this street that you see behind me, which runs right in front of the restaurant. But regardless of that location, this morning's shooting is just the latest in a series of unsolved cases here in Colorado Springs. The weekend of violence started early Friday morning at Havana Grill. According to police, at a little after 2 a.m., one person was shot and killed. Then later Friday, a second confirmed shooting, just 14 hours later when an afternoon road rage incident escalated further. Friday afternoon, two shots were fired by an angry driver. The victim was shot in the shoulder. The victim is okay, but police have not found the suspect. An hour and 40 minutes later, police responded to a third shooting the first of two over the weekend at Springs gas stations. A man in his 40s was killed at a come and go on Hancock Expressway. That suspect is also still at large. Then Saturday morning came, and so did a fourth shooting. Another gas station, but this time the shooting was prompted by a robbery in action. The alleged robbers reportedly fired at a store worker and fled from the scene. They too are still at large. That leads to Sunday morning, the fifth shooting. At the scene, police told KRDO they do not believe these incidents are connected, but the investigations are ongoing. There has been one person transported to the hospital. The extent of injuries cannot be released at this time. Police saying the public should remain calm. There is no uh, danger to the community that we're aware of. It appears to be an isolated incident. And according to the owner of Havana Grill, he tells us that this morning's shooting started with a collision between two cars. The driver who was hit then got out of his car and started firing at the other driver. And again, we've reached out to Colorado Springs police for more information, but we are still waiting to hear back. Live in Colorado Springs, Annabelle Childers, KRDO, News Channel 13.